Alright, sorry about that slight interruption. Uh, my program decided to freeze, so... That's weird, but anyways, we are back. No. Wow, wow, wow. Oh yeah, so anyway, uh, yeah. I thought Spanish was the main language. I know a lot of the different Spanish countries like that have different variations on the language, but for the most part, I'm pretty sure it's all Spanish. Got him anyways. <laughs> ah, I dropped down. I didn't have any room to scoot and I almost died. Almost time for fireworks. Okay. Can't miss my fireworks, you guys. <laughs> we bought a lot, uh, about three hundred fifty dollars worth of fireworks. So as you can understand, I do not want to miss. Got an ink barrage too, I see. Oh my gosh. Those last second comebacks. That double kill. Brilliant. Amazing. I'm slowly climbing my way up to 300,000 coins. I need to buy stuff. The thing is, is, I don't have anything else to really spend it on other than uh, weapon slot rerolls. And I'm pretty satisfied with all of my slots for now. Except for my hat. I might change that because I just got it today. And some of the abilities could use some tweaking. Come on, Team Cat. Let's go. Not you, Cat. <laughs> Our naked cat is right here. About to jump on my lap, it looks like. 
I don't know if the microphone can even hear her meowing right now. I don't think so. She is adorable though. As much as I despise Team Cat. <laughs> I'm out. Deuces. Bye bye. Jeez. That gold dynamo roller is insane. Quantos Santos. Quantos años tienes? Uh, you're, luckily for you, I do know a little bit of Spanish. So, um, I'm, I'm 21 years old. 21 años. That's about all I know in terms of responding to that in Spanish. But yeah, I'm 21 going on 22. I'll be 22 in February, which is kind of far from now, but... Actually, it doesn't feel like it's that far from now. <sighs> How embarrassing, I got splatted by a sprinkler. Concentration right here at its finest. Jeez, that has a long. Jeez, that has a long range. Yo, what's up, Zio Drifter Two <laughs> Thousand? Here, I'll, I'll type back a message for you. <laughs> Yo, what's up, dude? Oh, no wonder. They only had two, two cats on their team. <laughs> I feel a little bit less great about that victory. Alright, yeah, I'm definitely gonna exit the lobby and go reroll my abilities for that hat. Because those are all over the place. Oh, and if you haven't seen the plaza since this update, here it is. It's nice and big and lit up and pretty and nighttime. I love it. So let's go find Spike. All right, uh, let's get some slots going. I would really like to know when we get our super sea snails. Oh my god, I just said it without even centering. I was having a, such a hard time saying that earlier. Super sea snails. Super, super, super sea snails. Okay, so we got two ink savers on the sub. Nah, nah, I'm gonna have to reroll that one. Uh. Do I like that? 
Let's see, we got swim speed, speed shoulder duration. Uh, yeah, let's try one more time. So yeah, Zeo Drifter, if you want to join in, uh, if you have uh, this on your Wii U, feel free to add me and you can get in our lobby. I don't know if I already said that, though. <laughs> ah, jeez. Okay, we'll do one more. Oh, man, I'm, I'm using all my gold really fast. Uh, I think I'm actually okay with that. Yeah, ink saver on your main weapon, and then damage increase. Yeah, I like that. I'm good. I'm good with this. Back to multiplayer. Meow. You biased little kitty. I bet he's been rigging the counts at the end of the game so all the team dog teams lose. <sighs> Alright, so I'm at a plus 13 right now. That's pretty good. It's, uh, I think the second highest I've been. I've been at a plus 16. And that was last night before I went on today's losing streak earlier. <laughs> that was off stream though, so thankfully nobody saw that. That was embarrassing. <laughs> you know Oh, you're on holiday? Oh that's unfortunate. Well, I, ho I hope you enjoy it. Um, my favorite game of E3... Um, oh man, that's a tough one because I, pl I, got to I got to play almost all of them. Except for the ones with the really long lines like Tomb Raider and, you know, uh, Halo 5. All the really big titles like that had really, really long lines. I didn't get to play anything virtual reality because you had to make an appointment for that. You had to make an appointment to try it out, which was crazy, but, um, I guess, I won't say it's my favorite, but it was one of my favorites, um, I'm gonna have to go with Mario Maker, Mario Maker was one of my favorites because it was, like, uh, I'm not too big of, like, a level designer person, but I think it's gonna be really fun to be able to play other people's creations and see how they mess with the whole, uh, making of a Mario level. I thought that one was really fun. Uh, Rock Band 4. I'm really hyped about that. Uh, I've been playing ever since 1. I got the full band kit when Rock Band 1 came out and I've been a fan ever since. Uh, that one was fun. Cuphead. I don't know if you know about Cuphead, but that one was really, really good. I got to listen to the music through some headphones while I was playing and it played really nice and it sounded really good. It sounded like like one of those old Walt Disney cartoons from like the 50s. It was really, really cool. And then another favorite of mine was probably... Oh man, it's so tough because there were so many good ones. Uh... Fable Legends. Fable Legends was another fun one. Oh man, they boxed me in. Uh, Fable Legends was good. Uh, I did not think I was gonna like it because it's really really different from the other games in the Fable franchise But I had a lot of fun uh, You know, it's like a it's like a top-down real-time strategy game And it fits really well into the Fable universe surprisingly for me anyway um, So yeah, that was fun and then lastly I guess one of my other highlights is Gears of War Ultimate Edition Again, I've been a fan ever since the first one came out, and it just it just played really, really well. So yeah, those are a couple of my favorites from E3. I probably would have said Tomb Raider would have been one of my favorites too if I had the chance to play it, as well as uh, the Oculus Rift. 
I was really, really hoping I could try the Oculus Rift, but I think uh, appointments were booked up like a week in advance, so even if I did want to make an appointment, you couldn't do it while you were there, which was unfortunate. But I'll be able to play it at some point, once it finally comes out. Which is looking really, really cool. They hosted that press op press conference for it before E3 started. I think it was like a few days before. And they showed off a couple of the new stuff and the new games and how it comes with the next Box One controller. All that stuff was really, really cool. Okay, yeah, definitely uh, Nintendo Digital was really, really awful. So the, the thing about it was, I was going into it I was, I was in my hotel room, right, and I was getting really hyped, I was like, oh yes, oh my god, finally up here, I'm gonna be able to play all these awesome Nintendo games because they're gonna unveil, like, you know, Metroid and, like, Animal Crossing Wii U and all these other titles that people have just been waiting for for so long, and then it's like, uh, that Animal Crossing music starts to play and I get hyped and it's like, oh yeah, Animal Crossing finally for Wii U, and then it's Amiibo Party <laughs> for Animal Crossing. Uh, Animal Crossing Amiibo Party. So I was like, okay, um, you know, I could take a loss, uh, I guess I'll wait for Metroid? And then they unveiled Metroid, and it was that Blast Ball thing from the Nintendo Championship, and I was like, oh, that's not good. So I kept watching, and, uh, I think the only cool thing I, that I saw throughout the whole stuff was the Amiibo things. Uh, the Skylanders partnership was really cool for people that like Skylanders. I thought their designs for Bi Bowser and Donkey Kong were pretty interesting. Um, I don't know if they unveiled this at, uh, at the digital event, but all their new Smash amiibos coming out are really cool looking. Especially that Mr. Game & Watch. That is looking really hype. Um, yeah, and the Yoshi's Woolly World amiibos are adorable. Other than that, it was just a really, like, underwhelming digital event, so I will definitely agree with you on that one. It was just not Nintendo's year, I guess, but they still had some pretty cool stuff to play with at E3. You got an iPhone 5S a few days ago, that's pretty cool. Is that what you're watching it on right now, the stream? My dad, I think, has an iPhone 5S. Actually, no, I think he upgraded to the 6. I'm not sure. But yeah, I have an iPhone as well. I have an iPhone 6. Once again, so we're getting close to the end of the day here in Splatfest, and I've only seen a few other king ranks, which is a little strange. I don't know if it. Oh, that sucks. They got stuck with three people on their team. Why would it even start? Why would they let the game start when they only had three people? That's unfortunate. I got him. Oh, no, they got me. <laughs> I 
Man, I missed the Splattershot Jr. I used that for such a long time after this game came out. For, uh, like, when this game first came out, I was using it, like, for for weeks. Until I finally got off into a different gun. Should probably pick it up again sometime soon. Just because it's a beginner weapon doesn't mean it's bad. I actually think it's pretty good. Especially with that bubbler ability. See, that's, that's why it's a good weapon right there. She survived all those bombs and still got me. That's lag or whoa, yeah, that's definitely lag. Yo, yo, jeez. <laughs> I walked right into that one. <sighs> Excellent. Another win for Team Dog. Unfortunate for Team Cat, they only had three people. So it seems like we're hovering around 13, plus 13 for that so hot ranking. That so hot ranking. Harry Potter. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, waiting for team cat. Waiting for Team Cat. game especially splatfest it's really awesome Live 
living though. Oh jeez. We still living though. <laughs> we still living though. <laughs> Get him, Charger, get him. Take that, Chuck. I'm out. Skiddly do. What did I just hear? I'm not risking it. Could have been a Kraken. Going back in. Get off my back. Get off my butt crack. Just get off crack in, in general. Don't do crack. Oh man. Poopy doos. Poopy doos. I'm not sure if we're winning this one, you guys. I'm not sure if I'm winning that one. Yes. Wow, that was that was close. <sighs> Very close indeed. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and switch weapons now. What do I feel like using? That's a good question. It's between the blaster and the roller. Uh, actually, no. Now talking about it, let's go with... Where is it? Ah! Splattershot Jr. Latashad Junior, here we go. Ah yes, my good old splatter shot. How I've missed B. Although I do see why I was using other guns for a little bit. Hmm. 
Really? I just cleaned that up. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? No. Why did I do that? I thought I had the bomb barrage. That's funny. Hitting me. Leave me alone! Jeez, they were just pushing me! <laughs> Alright. Let's continue the carnage. Too busy blocking out the haters. You know, for a beginner gun, the Splatter Shot Junior is really good. I say beginner gun because it's one of the first weapons you can even buy. Oh. Yeah, uh, blasters are pretty hard to deal with. Because they have such a wide uh, area of effect. Uh, nah, I don't know about that one. Yeah, I didn't think so. Unfortunately. Why is it taking so long? I want to hit, yeah! No, seriously, why is this taking so long? I think we're stuck in forever misery. I think this has happened to me before. Eventually it stopped. Can't go home either. Uh, what do I do? Okay, here we go. Uh, I'll just go to a different lobby. <laughs> Just in case it was one of those people lagging us behind. Ain't the most tough to win, Walleye Warehouse. Let's go, let's go. 
What is my sub for this? I don't even think I was good enough to use subs. Oh yeah, it's just a standard bomb. When I say I wasn't good enough, I guess I just didn't have it in my mind as much as I do now. Now that I'm a bit more experienced and well versed in how this game works. Some even really not really very useful in some so What just happened? Oh wow, okay, I finally- oh, Die! Oh! What kind of alien font is that? Or <laughs> language, I mean. Trying. Never mind. Oh, here we go. Tell me something. Guy. I don't believe that for one second. Jeez. Well, I think the cats have it this round. Yes, they do. Unfortunately. <laughs> Still the dog king, though. <laughs> oh no, it's happening again. <laughs> It wasn't as long that time. So I'm gonna go ahead and find a new lobby anyways. Damn. Cassie, Felipe, and Daniel. I'm putting my faith in you. And you better deliver, or you'll have some explaining to do. And I will ink all over you. Maybe this is why they had it held back two weeks. Flatfest. It takes significantly longer to find a match than we would have in regular uh, 
matchmaking. Feeling brave, I got my bubbler going. Oh no. I was not anticipating that. Jeez. Oh my god. I bet he was waiting too. He was like, just go ahead and use your bubbler, I dare you. Get out, get out. died for me like breathing too close to him. <laughs> he died really fast. Yeah, take that. There's revenge on that guy with the bubbler. that through. That guy didn't know. Get out, leave me alone. Man, I'm being chased down. Wow. I just let him have it there. Round. <laughs> that was a very messy round. Well, that's okay. Yeah, I think I'm gonna switch weapons now. Uh, I guess I'll go with a little bit of the roller. Carbon roller. Carbon roller it is. Oh, God. Splatfest, more like lagfest. <laughs> I see nothing but champions. All day, every day, champions.
No, it's okay, Team Cat. Take your time. Cat King! Cat King! There's a king! There's another king rank! Oh, not alone. I mean, I knew I wasn't alone. I just haven't seen any in matchmaking. I thought I was the Splattershot Jr. Man, I'm switching it up. I'm getting lost today. Now, 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 now! Yes, 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 yes! Whoa, no, no! No, no, no! <laughs> Jeez. That was really close. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Did not see that. Sometimes there's just so much stuff going on I don't even realize little things like that. See that Inkzuka blinking in the back of my eye, the corner of my eye. I just don't have an opportunity to use it yet. What? That was way too fast. Oh, well, he's got three damage ups, so I guess that kind of makes sense. <laughs> Excuse me, don't mind me. Oh, they minded me. <laughs> they minded me very much. Yo, let's go! The turnaround's last second. Come on, let's go! Oh, please. That would have been so awesome. Come on. I don't know. I'm not too sure about it, but let's go. Oh, my God. That double kill almost got us the game. That was really close. Again with these really long ending screens. No, it's okay, Splaton, take your time. Alright, got a couple more rounds in me and then I'm gonna go head on out for some 4th of July festivities down by the lake. Hi, Kevin.
Team Cat up to their usual shenanigans and not enjoying the game. Good, good, good. We got some fiends in here. For those that don't know, that's the first rank for uh, Splatfest. It's Fiend, Defender, Champion, and then King. At least for this Splatfest, anyway. I'm sure there's different names for other themes. Oh dang, this is almost a team of all carbon rollers. I think they're all carbon rollers, and this is an, at least one other one. Yes. I love when they do that, because they make themselves so vulnerable. Ah! He was behind the wall. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why, get out of here. I hit you before you hit my teammate. Oh! You sneaky snake. You sneaky squid, you. Oh man, I was hoping to pop off and catch him by surprise. Freaking die, jeez. <laughs> Same goes to you, wherever you are. Oh, we got this guy. Yeah, there he goes. Well, I think we turned it around. Last minute there. Yes, we did. Excellent. Excellent. Sweet. Once again, a long ending screen. <laughs> what is up with that? <sighs> splatoon, splatoon, splatoon. You silly game, you. I blame Splatfest for all these connectivity issues.
There we go. We've got a game going now. Team Cat, Team Cat. What are we gonna do with you? Hmm? almost all rollers again on the other team this time. That's what I do at the beginning of every match almost. Do like a sprinkler at the top of the base. Oh, I thought if I ran through, I'd have been able to squeeze in. Guess not. Get out, get What? Just happened. <laughs> Did it see? Ah, oh, Splatfest, what are you doing? Oh man. Wow, that actually kicked me out to the plaza that time. Actually, you know what? That is a good spot to end it. Uh, Splatoon might be trying to tell me something by doing that. <laughs> You've been playing for too long. Go spend time with your family. Uh, which I think I will go do now. Um, it's 4th of July, so we're going to go light off some fireworks uh, over the lake. As I said earlier, we bought about like $350 worth of fireworks. So we're going to go have fun lighting those off, celebrating, having a good time. Thank you all for joining for the first... Uh, not my first live stream, but my first Splatoon live stream, and I hope the quality was okay. Uh, I did some fine tuning oops, over uh, the course of the week to make sure that the stream looks good, and I'm gonna try and start streaming more regularly. So yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for everyone for hanging out, and I will see you all in the next video as always. Bye bye. <laughs>